just got our keys to the new spot. Shorty is super hype, okay? Forehead's hella shiny. Okay, we don't care. So yeah, we just got the keys, so I'm just gonna give you guys an empty apartment tour of the new spot. So as soon as you walk in, it's the kitchen. Um, got this lovely, I think it's like a pantry. As soon as you walk in, it's the kitchen. Um, so this is a cute little pantry area. I'm here, I'm here for the storage space. I don't know what happens after you turn 30. You just really want storage space. Then, oh, I got ice already. That's interesting, probably gonna dump that out. But this, oh wow, this fridge looks kind of spacious. So, yeah, I got the fridge, stainless steel, refrigerator. Never had one of these before. I'm feeling like real, <laughs> real luxurious and bougie or whatever. <laughs> but yeah, so we got that. Then we have all of these cabinets. Look at all of these cabinets, guys. Okay, cabinets on cabinets on cabinets. Here for you. But my favorite point, my favorite selling point of this apartment, hands down, the counter space. Okay, do you see all of these plugs? It's like, it's telling me I have to get appliances. And then look at this, look. Bruh. Lighting, I'm here for it. Um, and then we have our lovely island, which I'm so pumped. Like, I get to get some bar stools so I can have more seating. So, I love this kitchen. This was like one of my main reasons for getting this house. And then these two lights here, I'm just so excited. This house, my apologies, it's an apartment. Um, but yeah, I'm so in love with the kitchen. Like, I feel like this is great. So this is the living room area. I honestly think that I am like giving up space from my old apartment to this apartment and as far as the living room goes. Um, so it's just this area here right next to the kitchen. Got the balcony over there. So I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like mount a TV here. My TV is not currently mounted, but pretty sure that's what I'm gonna do in this place because I just wanna maximize as much space as possible. Um, so that is the living room. Uh, I guess I'll show you guys the balcony. So this is the balcony. I'm not trying to show y'all where I live. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. But this is the balcony. Got some more storage space. Ooh, it's flies out here. So more storage space. In the balcony. Get me a little bicycle and whatever. So yeah, this is the balcony spot. It's pretty spacious. I already have some um, balcony furniture for my current apartment, but I think I'm going to get some new stuff. <laughs> so that's the balcony. Then from the living room, you come over here. I think this is just like a utility closet. This would be where I would put my dining table. I honestly thought that my dining table was gonna be too big for this space, but I think it will fit. Um, I'll just have to see like once it gets in here. All of my movers are actually coming tomorrow. So we'll see. So before we go into the bedroom, we have more storage space. And this is like, you know, the open storage space. So this will probably just be for like, you know, little decorative accents, stuff like that. So I'm just here for the storage space. And this is my lovely bedroom with a beautiful large window here. So I love this bedroom. I love the natural light. That was like another selling point because my current apartment had like zero natural light. My windows, they face my uh, apartments, like other apartments. So I don't get any natural light. And so this one, I'm pretty sure, I just know I'm just gonna be happier. You know what I mean? Cause natural light just brings me joy. So this is my bedroom closet. And you just enter in this way. I like the double door situation, okay, here for it. This is the walk-in closet. It's nothing crazy, but it'll fit. I don't have that many clothes anyways. 
So that is the closet. And then off from my bedroom is the restroom. More storage space. Yes, ma'am. Then we have our lovely double sink. It's only me moving in here. So I didn't, I honestly, when I said, like when I agreed to this apartment, I didn't realize that I got a double sink, but it's still, it'll be cool for like when I have guests or whatever. So yeah, and then this never been sat on toilet. So excited for that. And then this tub. This was my other selling point of this apartment. It has literally been like years since I've taken like a bath because like my current apartment, you could just tell like someone else lived there before me and I was not about to take a bath. Like shower is cool, bath, I just couldn't do it. So yeah, this is the bathroom and this is back to the laundry in the kitchen area. But in the bathroom, we also have Love it. And then we have all of these little um, cabinets for like my little toiletries and things and sing things and such and things hanging on the So yeah, and then this beautiful mirror. That's sweet. Hey guys. Beautiful mirror in the restroom. I don't really know what this is called. I don't know. Uh granite, I'm sure. I don't, I don't know. I really don't, I don't love granite. I like quartz, but it'll do, you know. So yeah, that is essentially it for the apartment tour. So I'm just, I'm so excited. This is like my first, you know, nice apartment. Like I got counter space, like. <laughs> Yeah, I'm really excited. I got my keys today. My movers come to my apartment to pick up all of my like heavy, you know, the furniture tomorrow between eight and 10. So I'm just really excited about it. Um, I honestly feel like I'm going to be happier here. I really do because natural light truly does something to me. I think it's like a, a fact for everyone. Like natural light helps. So yeah, I'm excited about the natural light. I'm excited about these wood floors. I don't think I showed you guys the wood floors. Hold on. So the wood floors, that was like done on purpose. I really, really wanted an apartment that had wood flooring because as I told you guys, I intend on getting a puppy. And I really didn't want to be like training a puppy with carpet. And even though I have carpet in my bedroom, that's the only room in this whole apartment that has carpet. So, he just ain't gonna come up in my bedroom. So yeah, I'm just so excited guys. Like, I'm so happy. Um, but let me just talk a little bit about moving when you are 24 hours away from most of your family and friends. So specifically to Dallas, they have this program called You Move Free. So if you're moving to Dallas, look up You Move Free. This is not sponsored, I wish. Feel free, feel free to sponsor me, guys. Um, but yeah, so You Move Free, they will, one, they'll help you locate an apartment. They'll give you like an apartment locator. You let them know your price range, what area you're interested in, and they will like give you a list of options that you can look into for apartments. I reached out to them when I was originally apartment hunting, but I actually didn't find my apartment through them. But I put their name on my rental application. And so when you put their name down, like they refer to you, you either get $250, which is like, who's turning down free money? Not me. So you either get $250 or you get a free move. So when I originally moved to Dallas, I have no furniture. So I'm like, I don't need a move. I need some money. 
So my first apartment, I put their name on my application. They mailed me a check for $250. Clear, free, cashed it, went grocery shopping. It's lit, right? So, but for this one, because I've like accumulated furniture, I've accumulated all kinds of stuff in my current apartment since I've been living there, literally since November 2018, I moved into my old apartment. And um, yeah, so now I decided to, I'm, I put you move free on my application again, and they will be moving me tomorrow. And so with the free move, you get free, you get two and a half hours free. And then anything beyond the two and a half hours is an additional $90 an hour or something like that. But I have a one bedroom. They don't move bags or uh, luggage or TVs that are not in boxes. So everything that I have packed in bags, luggage, and my televisions, because I've already gotten rid of the boxes, I have to move myself. So the good thing is, like I signed my lease with my current apartment today. Today is April 30th. My lease at my old apartment, it's not up until May the 8th. So I have that time, like if I want to like slowly get stuff out, I can do that. So, and I know it's probably echoing in here because I literally have nothing in here right now. But yeah, so yeah, if you're looking to move to Dallas area, I don't know if it's like the whole entire state of Texas, but I know for Dallas area, you move free and it's the letter U, like youmovefree.com. And they'll help you find apartments give you some free money for those groceries because you know when you move like it's a drain on your pockets when you move so it's like a really good i think it's a great resource i have never used the movers so i'll have to keep you guys updated on that but i'm really excited i hope i get to get my dog soon i'm thinking about going through um my friend, my friend Brooke, hey Brooke, my friend, she told me I need to get a rescue dog because I was like, oh, well, I want a golden doodle. I want a golden doodle, and that's it. <laughs> that's that. Give me a golden doodle. But um, she kind of talked me into getting a rescue, so now I'm like a little bit more open to the ideas and like different types of dogs and different breeds. Cause I think it would be kind of cool getting a rescue. And the reason why I was waiting was because I went through one website, it's called Dallas Dog RRR. I think it's like or whatever, I don't know. So yeah, Dallas Dog Rescue or something like that. They, they require like with your application, you have to show them like your living space. And I'm just like, well, I'm about to be moving, so I don't want to show them this living space. But they're like, they're pre they seem to be pretty thorough in their, you know, adoption process. So I wanted to wait until I was in my place that I really wanted to bring my dog to, and I was settled. So yeah, I'm excited to start dog shopping soon. I'm just, I feel really happy, really happy, and really excited. Like I didn't show you guys because I didn't want you to know, like exactly where I am but there's like a body of water like if I sit on my balcony I can look at the water it's beautiful and then they have like because it's a building it's not like a um you know sometimes you open your apartment door and you're outside and it's like a breezeway here it's like a building so when I go open my door I'm in a hallway and so they have like the uh, pool they have the gym in here like everything is in the building so i'm also happy about that because shorty hates to go to the gym like i can't stand it but it's even worse when i have to like go to my car and what if it's raining like i don't have time for that shorty still might not go like it might still be downstairs and i might just be up here like watching netflix but I just think like it's more likely that I'll go because it's in my building. Like I can literally get on the elevator and go to the gym. So yeah, I'm really excited guys. Like I'm really happy. I think this was like a really good move. Um, yeah, I'm just happy. I'm so happy. So that first, oh, and then another thing about this place, I get eight weeks free. So because these these apartments, they were actually like just, just built. So 
literally when I say no one has ever lived in this apartment, like no one has ever lived in this apartment. So they just built these apartments and they were running a special where you get eight weeks free. So I'm moving in August 30th. I don't have to pay my rent again until July. Like, I mean, April 30th. Yeah, so April 30th, and then I don't have to pay my rent again until July the 1st. I'm gonna use that time to like pay a little extra or whatever. But yeah, like, can't beat that. Can't beat it. And these are like really nice apartments. Like, they, I believe that they took their time. I'm really excited to get some bar stools. I want to, like, entertain here. You know what I mean? Like, I love the open space, like, the open floor plan. It's just, it's beautiful. And these... But, yeah, I'm just, I'm so happy. And I'm actually, like, my friend is coming into town next week, so she'll be here, and she'll get to see the new place. Like, I'm really excited. And, yeah... I'm just gonna go now, guys, because I need to go finish packing and like bring some, start bringing some stuff to the new place. But yeah, if you have any questions about moving to Dallas, any suggestions about areas, I stay in North Dallas, um, essentially because the job that I got when I moved here was in North Dallas. So that was like the area that I was exposed to the most. But now I'm like working from home, so. I stayed in North Dallas because it's the area that I'm familiar with, but I can really go anywhere because my job isn't really talking about sending us back to work. Speaking of work, I need to get a desk. I got stuff to do, guys. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share with a friend, and a friend, and a friend, and a friend, and a friend, 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 fri